Hello everyone, Dino back here with more fragrance content. Um, I would not say that this is a review, more of the first impressions. I wanted to show something that I got on sale. I got this Kenneth Cole set here. Uh, I believe it was $19. I thought it was actually nice because it does include three fragrances. In my collection, I don't have any Kenneth Cole. About 10 years ago, I had Kenneth Cole Reaction, and it was... Uh, two watermelon for me. I wasn't a big fan. I'm not a big fan of watermelon fragrances like uh, Nautica Voyage or a Paris Hilton for Men. I just don't really care for that note. But I thought it was a pretty good deal. It came with comes with three uh, fragrances, all 0.5s. So in total, it's about 1.5 ounces of uh, fragrance. And you get the Kenneth Cole Black, uh, Kenneth Cole Blue in Vintage Black. So I was going to go ahead and do a first impressions on this. I've not tested them and I've not smelled them yet, but I thought it'd be interesting to see what I think of them. So we'll go ahead and I'll start by opening up the package. And I'll go ahead and start with the first one. The first one that I'll take a look at here is Kenneth Cole Black. This is the original. I believe it was released in 2003 by Kenneth Cole. I'll go ahead and spray it on my left hand. Pretty nice itemizer there. It's so just a plain plastic cap. So go ahead and see what I think of this one here. All right. This one, I have to say, is pretty fresh. Um, I'm getting a mint smell in there. It is a little bit synthetic, but I think it's actually pretty fresh. It smells like something, you know, right out of the shower. I think it's actually pretty nice. It's uh, not offensive. I can see it maybe for everyday wear to like the office around town. But I think it actually smells pretty good. The second one of the set I'll look at here is Kenneth Cole Blue. It's just a plastic cap on here as well. I'll put this on my right hand and see how this one goes. Itemizer is quite nice as well. I'll let the alcohol die down. This one was actually released in 2015 by Kenneth Cole. Um, I believe the notes on it are citrus and sea notes. Uh, probably better for summer wear, but I'll go ahead and see what I think of this one. This one, right off the bat, is kind of giving me a very Versace, you know, off fresh, man off fresh. It smells very much similar to that. I think it's actually pretty good, but it's not my favorite. It just smells kind of like it's been done before. But uh, overall, not, not bad. It just I can see this more for kind of hotter weather. Uh, and But I think it's actually quite light, which is nice. And the last one that comes in the set is the Kenneth Cole Vintage Black. This was released in uh, 2009. I'll go ahead and spray this on my arm and see how this one is. I believe this one has notes of tequila and lavender, which I can already get a whiff of. So I'll go ahead and take a smell of this one here. Oh, yeah. This one smells very similar to the black, but it is powdery. I think that is the lavender coming out in it. Yeah, it's all right. It's not my favorite of the set, but, uh, you know, I'd have to give these more time to dry down and see what I think of them. But it, it's just, it, it's a little, the lavender is a little bit too much for me, is, you know, what I think. All in all, I don't think this was a bad buy at all. You know, I think it was $19 or so, and you get three cents, which I didn't think is too bad. Um, they're all... Eau de Toilette Concentration. I think of all three, my favorite is just the regular Kenneth Cole Black. I think it's the most fresh of the three. Again, that uh, Vintage Black, the Lavender, kind of killed it a little bit for me. But, you know, I don't know. It's, that's just kind of my thoughts of them. I'd have to give them a little bit more wear and see how they do. Well, that is my first look here at the Kenneth Cole fragrances. I've always wanted to own black, so I'm glad to have these other two with it. Uh, I'd have to give them more time on my skin to see how they fare, and maybe do some full reviews of them. But anyway, go ahead and drop me a like, comment, and tell me, have you had these? Uh, do you have any uh, suggestions or any favorites of this bunch that I just took a look at? Go ahead and drop it below in the comments. Thank you for watching again. Uh, Sense with Dino, and I'll see you next time.